welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be doing another boxy charm boxing and this one is the january box um so i kind of went through it already because i was super excited to see what i got which i was disappointed again so these are the products that i got and i got more skincare which i wasn't happy about because on the um website i put that i wanted mostly makeup and some skincare or like besides makeup things which i didn't get i got mostly you know the they actually gave me the um paper that i could read off and tell you guys what they are and um the prices of the things so to start off i got the Too faced diamond highlighter and this one $36. So this one of a kind highlighter is infused with real crushed diamond powder and light reflecting pearls for a brilliant fancy pink diamond glow that light up your complexion with pure pink radiance, which already gets me nervous because I don't like pink highlighters at all. I only like like the gold ones. So how it looks. So it's in this container and then we're in another big container right here, which is really cute, which I heard a lot of people say. Is it pink though? I don't know. Gold. It looks gold and pink at the same time. So I don't know. But I'm gonna try it out. But the packaging is cute. Um, I got this and it's Mana Beauty Simplified. And this one is $21. It's a matte, a matte lip color that is whipped to perfection, easy to apply, and formulated with long-lasting pigment that don't dry out your lips. So, and it's like in a dark red which i don't ever wear so here's that and then we are gonna go in with the dr brandon's skin changing science 24 7 retinol cream eye cream it says with ruby crystal complex an aging fighting eye cream a perfect combination of retinol and ruby crystal complex that gives your eyes the attention they deserve this eliminates the eye contour Help smooth away lines, help reduce moisture loss. So it is just apply to the bone area of the eye in AM and PM. So you use it morning and night. So yeah, that's one of the items I got. And then I got the, I'm gonna go in with this one because this one for me was the most expensive, which kind of sucks because instead of giving me, you know, I don't know, makeup, I'd rather have gotten like a palette that cost like 50 bucks or something but this one was 107 and this is Avon. don't know how to pronounce it but then it is a eight hour radiance renewal sleeping mask so there's that and then i got the skin and co roma Tru truffle their therapy so this one's a polishing micro Explode, exfoliating truffle face gomage. I have no idea. So there's that. And this one was $28. And it says it's a delicate exfoliating cream with a rich, textured, and smoothing fragrance. It says Italian spa experience. And it says gently buffs away and erase dull, lackluster skin, revealing a more luminous and healthy complex. So this is the last product I got, which, like I said, I wasn't, I'm not a big fan. That was everything. So I'm not wearing makeup or anything like that. So I could try out the exfoliating. Um, I have my like face wipe and everything ready for me to use. And then to read it, it says it has black truffle extract to obtain from black winter truffle, which is an anti-aging, antioxidant powerhouse ingredient because of its ability to protect against free radical damage. It says it has apricot seed powder. And then it says it's known to gently exfoliate and promote the Removal and uh, removal of dull damage and dead skin cells. We're good, and then I'm gonna just grab 
my face towel and I'm gonna just which does make my face feel a bit more softer and I could feel like the residue left over which it does my face does feel really clean now and it feels really soft so and I always do get dry on my nose and it doesn't look so dry right now so I mean it's actually nice so I do like that where to put it <laughs> I'm like looking for the product so yeah so this is actually really nice and it, my face feels really soft right now so I'm gonna keep using it and see how it works for me it has 5.07 um, fluid ounces so I mean it has a good amount of product in it next we are gonna go in well I can't use the eight hour radiance from your sleeping mask right now so this you just apply and I might put it on I'll probably use this one last because it has a thin layer to clean dry skin allowed to absorb into the skin no need to wash off so I might use this later because I do want to try out the highlighter and then I'll probably try out the lipstick since I really didn't get anything else besides those things next I'm gonna go in with the 24 7 retinol eye cream so where's the, the brand so this one oh, it just like popped off so I'm gonna get so far my two first boxes they weren't that great like I didn't get what was remote like most of the hype out of it so that sucks and I'm still on the waiting list for the premium which I'm just waiting to get because I'd rather just see if I get better products in that box which sucks because you can't cancel your boxy charm and be on the waiting list you have to get approved of the waiting list first so I put that on and I mean, it's just like a regular cream. So I don't know, I'm gonna use it every day and every morning and I wanna see if it actually does anything. I mean, I don't have wrinkles right now. So like, or probably, I mean, it's always good to be prepared. So there is that. And then with this, I am gonna hold off. Um, Should I go in with this? Okay, so this is how it looks. It does feel really comfortable. It doesn't feel like I have anything on my lips. It just feels really soft. I don't know. I, I like... Let's see how it dries. So, yeah. This one I don't hate. It feels really comfortable. I wonder how long it will last, though. So, I would let you guys know as well. And then next should do some foundation or something but my face feels so clean right now i don't want to put makeup on especially just to take it off but here is the highlight on let's see how this looks <clears throat> let me see how it looks on the skin i mean it's cute i mean it doesn't look too pink that's good so that's how that looks you can see the pink, which I don't really like. Ugh. Well, we'll see. I don't know. I might try to get used to it. So yeah, so, so this boxy charm for me was not a win. Yeah, and I'm pretty disappointed. So I mean, it's good to have this type of products, anyways. Oof, I dropped it. I'm dropping everything. Oh my gosh. Okay, so yeah, so these are the products that I got. Um, I will be testing out these products though because this is more like of a, you know, see if it doesn't break, like have my face break out or anything like that. And yeah, so my lips are drying now and they're feeling a kind of like dry. So we'll see how that looks and feels and wears. So yes, if you guys like this video, please don't forget to like it and subscribe and um, yeah, let's see what's February's box. Yes, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.